There are people who I like to call little white snowflakes, who get their panties in a bind every time someone says the phrase white people. You're, you're all up in arms. In fact, you some of you have gone to the, the degree where it's it's now about microaggressions. The tiniest little thing that might say something negative, that might even have in the most indirect way possible, the slightest tiny negative connotation to someone white and you're you're up in arms. Some of you get your panties in a bind if a movie or a program doesn't include white people or doesn't include enough white people. Like imagine if The Wiz was released today. Not a redo, not a remake of the old Wiz, but you know if if that was if the whole concept of let's do the Wizard of a black version of the Wizard of Oz, how how much it would piss off some of these little white snowflakes. I don't know What's happened in the past 10 to maybe 15 years, probably like 10 years though, that everyone's just gotten so fucking sensitive over, over any of that? Is it because some minorities are, are, are calling out what they see as microaggressions everywhere so you feel the need to do the same? Anyway, I'm gonna show a clip that I, I bet if this aired today, people would be making a big deal about it too. Here we go. The story of a people doesn't end until all their families are one. The issue is not the moral fiber of the black family. Until all their youth have hope. We have less children graduating now going to college than we did 20 years ago. Until all their rights are granted. Power concedes nothing without a struggle. Until all their people reach the promised land. We're determined to leave no one behind. Tell the story of my life. Friday at 10 p.m.